Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be starting putting down those two fields of alfalfa that I said we were going to do. Last week I said we were going to do them this week, so we are doing them this week. That's exciting, we're actually following our plans for once. And we we're only doing two of them. Dad said those were the only two that were uh, worth cutting, so we're going to do one uh, that second field we looked at in the previous video and then the fifth field we looked at in the previous video I believe so those are two we're gonna be cutting it's about 10 acres maybe 10 15 acres so we'll knock it out pretty quick probably take us an hour and a half two hours dad is working on getting the bales off the field that we did last week I should have told him to record something while he was doing it oh well uh, so he has got the skid loader and the 30 foot gooseneck trailer on his truck. Uncle Billy's up working on the automatic trying to get it working so he can get out there with that as well. But I don't know if that's gonna happen today or not. But we I just finished mowing hay. Uh, I did break down and I came up to the sh farm. Sad thing is, I, I broke down and all that was left in the field was a little two foot wide strip and it only went half the length of the field. So I ended up having to drive all the way back up to the farm, fix it, and drive all the way back over to that field, mow that strip, and then pack up and mow all the way back to the farm and to the other side of the farm in the opposite direction and mow another field. So that's how far apart those fields were so I am walking out in one of our old paddocks right now you can see behind me the automatic is over there sitting in the field dad's loading it and I'm gonna walk out here to uh, probably unload it by the time I get there I'm gonna have to drive it up and unload it but not fixed well I milked it out as long as I could and that's as far as she got it won't even start back up at this point so I am going to go get the truck and trailer and meet dad back out there because that thing is gonna need to cool down and maybe have to be worked on some before it'll go any farther And the bales are up here now. Dad's on his way up with the skid loader since it's right behind the farm. He just drives through the pastures, so we're waiting on him to come up, unload that. We're gonna see. I'm gonna see if he can unload the skid or unload the automatic where it's at, just to give it an easier time getting up here, because I think it's being under a load really doesn't help its ability to get up and go. But I still can't believe it's not fixed yet. We've done everything. We flushed. We uh, blew out the entire fuel system and completely primed it up and everything. So who knows what's wrong at this point in time.
got the tedding done. That's all I got done today. Sadly, I had a long day at school. So I'll see you guys tomorrow, hopefully. Hopefully a little bit earlier than I did today. Today we are going to get to work on my top. I did start putting clear coat on it yesterday, but it all started doing the whole orange peel thing where the paint starts flaking off. So we got to go through and put paint thinner and scrub down real good the area that I did clear coat, which happens to be this whole side and the whole windshield part and like halfway across this strip. So we're gonna do that. And then I'm going to test with like a real little area how it works if I put another coat of actual paint on and then put the clear coat on after that if I can actually do it. I don't know why. On the can it says after 48 hours of the paint curing you can go through and put your clear coat on but yet it doesn't stay. So I'm gonna figure this out and get to the bottom of it. I got the entire thing completely repainted. It is done. I'm just waiting on dad to get here so that I can put her on the Jeep. And one more thing, it's Thursday. Yep, so uh, this is an outro. So one more thing, we bought a, uh, a mystery item at an auction. You got, it's a mystery item for you guys. I know what it is. Dad knows what it is. Uncle Billy knows what it is. But I'm not going to tell you guys what it is until next video. So a little bit of suspense for uh, Sunday night, I think. Yeah, that's the upload day. A uh, little bit of suspense for you guys to find out what it is that we bought. And it's going to be good. But uh, it's going to have to wait till next video. So anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe and um, share, share the video.